All right, our top focus in a significant milestone for India's defense sector, India's, India's Hindustan Aeronautics Limited. It successfully completed the first flight of indigenous light combat aircraft Tejas Mark 1A fighter jet in Bengaluru. This was on Thursday. It recorded a flying time of 18 minutes. Notably, light combat aircraft has already been inducted by the Indian Air Force. It is equipped with enhancements that set it apart from its existing contemporaries. But what are these enhancements, you may ask? Let's find out more about the LCA MK-1A. To begin with, LCA MK-1A, it stands for Light Combat Aircraft Tejas MK-1A series. It's a domestically developed supersonic aircraft is used by the Indian military. The LCA, it's a tailless compound Delta aircraft equipped with quadruplex digital fly-by-wire. It's best suited for offensive support, air support, though it is of course obviously capable of carrying out other auxiliary functions as well. Speaking of its distinguishing features now, the Tejas MK-1A is equipped with Advanced Electronically Scanned Array or AESA radar and Advanced Self-Protection Jammer. These boast improved detection range and enhanced capabilities that are capable of tracking 16 targets together in air-to-air, air-to-ground and air-to-sea modes. The improved electronic warfare suite is one more such enhancement that has been introduced. The advanced electronic warfare suite enhances aircraft survivability. Additionally, the aircraft is capable of carrying payloads of 3,500 kilograms. It also features an advanced mission computer. Not only this, it also includes a high-performance digital flight control computer and is equipped with smart multifunction displays. However, its most prominent feature perhaps will be the inbuilt capacity to fire BVR or beyond visual range missiles. The indigenously developed BVR missile called Astra MK-1 that's expected to be integrated with the MK-1A, a weapon and feature that's likely to give the Tejas MK-1A an edge over its existing contemporaries. Now, as per reports, the fighter aircraft is likely to be deployed at Rajasthan's Nal Air Base, located in Bikaner. Additionally, India's Prime Minister Modi-led government has cleared a multi-billion dollar deal for 83 Tejas fighters. And the Defence Acquisition Council has granted the acceptance of necessity for 97 more Tejas MK-1A aircraft. For latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.